Hello and once again welcome to WS Cube Tech YouTube channel myself Omar Taskir and in this video I am going to talk about how can we actually connect Google search console and our website this is a, again a very important topic from search engine optimization point of view suppose uh, if you are having a very new website and if your website is new it is not possible for a crawler to come at your website and uh, and scan your website and uh, crawl your website and index your website as soon as your website is published because a uh, crawlers used to come to your website or crawlers used to visit any website uh, by the links they found on the internet right so if you uh, suppose for for this particular example if uh, the uh, domain of our website is wscube.com and there's no link on internet of wscube.com then it is it is very very difficult for the crawlers to come to our website right so this is a basic foundation that how crawlers actually come to your website if we talk about how crawlers actually come to your website then definitely the crawlers uh, used to uh, used to visit different links which are present on on other websites and uh, by those links by visiting those links they can come to your website so uh, if your website is new it is very obvious that you are not going to have so many backlinks or so your your website is not going to have those many backlinks and if your website is not going to have those many backlinks there's no chance uh, that crawler can come to your website uh, there's actually a product which is google search console now google says that uh, uh, okay your website is new uh, you want to get your website indexed you want to get your website ranked crawler might take a lot of time visiting your website so there is a tool which is google search console you can come and submit your and you can actually come and submit your uh, website website url domain or whatever thing you want to get indexed to our product which is google search console and our crawler will uh, index crawl and do the do the things uh, uh, from that particular product only right so if you are having any errors if you if you are there any errors from crawlers point of view then also you can analyze those uh, errors in that particular product so it's it's a very useful product right so uh, if you actually want to know how crawlers are interacting with your property or website then you should have a google search console account with you and your website should be connected with that particular google search console account right so i am having a google search console account over here it's a very simple thing you just type uh, google search console in google and then and then log in with your google id right so it's very simple now uh, you you'll see uh, some options like this you just click on the add property now i am actually telling you the steps how can you integrate your website and google search console so you are seeing url prefix over here just type this url over here right click on the continue now you'll be getting a code right so you see uh, there are different methods uh, by which you can actually verify right and uh, the one uh, the one which is recommended is html5 uh, just you have to upload this html file to your website but here is a html tag option uh, which is which is again a very easy and uh, very good method of uh, integrating these two things so i'll be clicking on html tag and you just have to copy this tag right so here's some instructions also basic instructions copy the meta tag below right this is the meta tag they are talking about and paste it into your site's home page and it should go in the head section right uh, you, you you note it very carefully it, it should go in the head section before the first body section so you have to find that head section right in your site's home page and then uh, there you actually have to paste this code and come back to this uh, this uh, platform and then you will be clicking on this verify and boom your code will be done right right your integration will be done so that is how you can do it and let's do it it's a very basic process nothing very technical nothing very complicated so uh, i'll be copying this thing right then i am coming to my website and on this website i am going to log in into my admin section right so you'll be logging into your admin section and there you actually have to find the header file right so you can find that in appearance you, you just have to go to appearance then theme editor right these are simple steps that you have to follow and within theme editor you have to find the here are different files right so you have to look for uh, header.php right this is a file that is going to load on each and every page of your website right so you just have to find header.php now here just look for the head section and body section so here is the head section and i'm already having a code over here in the head section with google tag manager okay avoid it for right now there's no need to get worried seeing this uh, complicated code right 
so you are having this code over here in the head section and here it is a uh, body right the body section so what was the instruction you have to paste this code in the head section before the body section actually starts from here onwards the body section is starting and uh, this is the ending point of head section so uh, copy once again right and just uh, enter over here paste this code the, this this simple step you have to do then click on the update file right just click on the update file file edited successfully come back over here click on the verify right it it will be checking for the verification and within seconds yeah here it is right so you see ownership is verified now verification method uh, the method that we actually followed was implementing html tag so you having html tag as a very verification method over here and you can click just click on the go to property now this particular dashboard is dedicated to how the crawlers are going to interact with your website right so whatever issues uh, whatever performance reports uh, sitemap reports coverage reports speed and the different tools uh, which are related with the search engines interactions with your website so you'll be seeing uh, reports over here after some time right as soon as the crawl comes to your website or the uh, crawler actually fetches uh, the information from your website you are going to see some good reports over here hopefully good reports over here right so that's it for this particular video i hope you have enjoyed this video you have understood how can we actually connect google search console with our website right so that's it for this particular video see you in the next video till then goodbye